Baby, baby, I'm here. Yeah, yeah, I was at work, <laughs> but but I was at lunch and and I saw your text and I I just needed to come over here to confirm because you usually said we couldn't and now you're suddenly saying we can, so I I I just wanted to confirm, okay? <sighs> yes, yes, I am out of breath. I ran here. <sighs> I j I don't know. I yeah. I, Probably could have taken my card, that would have been the smart option. Whew. But, but is it true, baby? Come on, you know what I'm talking about. The text you suddenly sent me? That we can finally go get a dog? Baby, come on, don't tease me. <laughs> I knew it, I knew it. Oh my god. Baby, what made you change your mind? Well, it's just... I hinted at wanting a dog, and sometimes I plainly, well, brought it up to you, but... Either you brushed me off, or that one time you pretended to ignore me. Oh, please, you were not wearing your stupid headphones. No, you weren't, because I purposefully checked after you ignored me. Just admit that you didn't want to get a dog, baby. <laughs> Seriously, though, what made you change your mind? Oh, God, of course it's the internet. All right, come on. What kind of video did you see that hooked you in? <laughs> Uh, of course, it's those rescue dog videos. Well, yeah, it's always fun to look at them. Who doesn't enjoy those? But, baby... <sighs> no, of course I'm happy, but deciding to get a puppy because you saw an internet video is questionable. You've been thinking about this for a while now. But... But I asked you two weeks ago, and you ignored me then, so what changed in those two weeks? You didn't want to tell me, did you? Well, if I know my sweetheart very well, which I would like to think that I do, you like surprising me, so you... Wanted to surprise me with this, didn't you? <laughs> God, I love you, baby. So, now that I'm here and I have about half an hour left for lunch, can we talk about getting a dog now? Come on, you knew that was going to be the first thing I said when I came back home. Yeah, yeah, fine, it's my fault for getting so excited at work that I ran home, but that's besides the point. And since you said that you've been thinking a little bit about it, I'm actually kind of curious. You know about what kind of dog you want, gender of the dog, whether to adopt one from a faraway place or adopt one here locally. Well, there's a lot of things that come with it. I mean, first of all, dogs can get pretty expensive depending on the kind of breed, and then you have to consider the size of the dog for your home, and... <laughs> right, right, I'm getting ahead of myself. But still, baby, how can I not be excited? Hmm, judging by your look... I would like to say that you're just excited as me, if not more. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretend not to care, baby. You already thought of a breed, then, yo. <laughs> oh, I knew it. What kind of dog does my baby want, then? Now I'm curious. Hmm, that does sound pretty interesting, I'll give you that much. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't stop smiling right now. 
I'm just happy. Happy that I get to be with you and that we might be getting a dog soon. <laughs> oh, don't think I haven't prepared for this. I know plenty of things. Well, for one, I looked up local pet stores and I... Well, sometimes during lunch or my breaks at work, when I know you're nowhere near certain places, I went to go check out some pet stores and see what they had to offer. <laughs> yes, yes, I know, I know, I shouldn't do that. What if I'm late at work because I'm too busy browsing the pet store and it's irresponsible because I didn't know we were gonna get them. But, but, on the bright side, there were like a lot of cute items that I saw. Well, there was this one dog bed that I swear to God could fit both of us at the same time, and it looked super comfy. It, it wasn't that expensive. If, if you don't count, um, well, if you don't count $200 to be expensive. Okay, fine, I was letting myself go a little bit, but there actually are some cute toys that I saw that were relatively cheap. And there were like water and food bowls, and I also googled some stuff about food and what kind of food to give what dogs, and... God, saying this out loud really makes me realize how much of a... Well, how much of an addiction I had. Well, it's really fun to just Google, you know? I really wanted to dog for a long while, and... Well, now it finally might be happening! Why, I want another dog? Right, I never told you, did I? Well... Well, first off, I spent a lot of my childhood with dogs, actually. Well, let's see... I had a brown Labrador for about nine years. His name was Let's Go. He was adorable, I'll have you know. And then when he died, we didn't have a dog for another three years, I think. And then we got another one, and his name was Bowie, and I loved him, and he was my best friend. He was like this adorable Belgian Shepherd, and he grew up to be so big. And then we got another Belgian Shepherd after that, because sadly... But we passed away to a few things, so he passed away early, which was really sad, and I still miss him. But after that, we got another one, and he was so adorable, and his name was Kane, and I loved him too. And then now my mom actually owns two dogs, and they're both rescues. Well, the past ones we all got from a breeder, so those two rescue dogs, they're special in my regard. But the point is... For the longest time, I grew up with dogs, and they were always really nice, and if I didn't want to spend time with people, which, being an introvert most of the time, I didn't, <laughs> but if I didn't, then I would just play with the dogs, and it made me happy. Having just a pet in general made me happy, but if I were going to get another pet, I would definitely want it to be a dog. Well, they're just... they're special in my heart. They hold a special place, so... I was very nervous asking you to finally, you know, consider getting a dog, because... I know that your brother was allergic, and that caused kind of a problem when you had a dog and he got allergic for some reason midway through having that dog. And I know that's not really the best memory for you, so I was actually really nervous to tell you I wanted a dog, and then suddenly you text me when I'm on lunch, and I just... I can't believe it's finally happening, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I'm being sappy. Make fun of me all you want. I love dogs. They... They're a big part of my childhood, so getting one with my baby, well, is a wonderful thing. And I'm very happy that I get to do it with you, baby. <laughs> the reason is simple. Because you already mean the world to me. And if we get a dog, there will be 
two people that mean the world to me. Just that one of them is a dog, and one of them is you. <laughs> fine, fine, I'll stop being so happy for now. Uh, before I say anything, can you just tell me what time it is right now? <laughs> I have to start running back to work and I'm gonna be late. Yes, yes, it's my fault. I ran here. We've been over this. I'll get home in a few hours, okay? Maybe we can do some more research and talk about it then? <laughs> You're the best, baby. I love you. And I'll be home soon. I promise. <laughs>